Good afternoon. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate something that has never been done on an EOSCO chain before today. I'm going to show how easy it is to be onboarded to the Telos blockchain by creating an account for free and loading that account with some funds so I can participate in the network's well-being. And this just takes three simple steps. The first thing we're going to do is download the newest version of Squirrel, which is version 1.1.0. We're then going to create a new account and import it into Squirrel. And finally, we're going to register to Carbon and start purchasing tokens. It's so simple. It's amazing. All right, let's get started. So the first thing you'd need to do is visit squirrelwallet.io. This is the new dedicated site for the Squirrel Wallet that allows you to find the latest version with ease. We also describe some of the functionality available in Squirrel. It's just a great example of creating beautiful UIs that can help users find what they need. Since I have Squirrel downloaded already, I'll skip that step. But visit squirrelwallet.io and select the version that matches your operating system. With Squirrel installed, it's very easy to get started. The first thing we need to do is select the network we're going to connect to. And this is all for the Telos blockchain. So in the Connect to Network section, I'm going to select Telos Mainnet. I don't have an account yet, so we're going to click Create New Account to get into the Telos blockchain. Um, the account name is a 12-character account name. And in this case, I'm going to see if Squirrel Wallet 1.1 is available, and it is. I'm going to generate my owner and active public keys for security purposes. Um, I'm going to copy and save these keys. Now, this is a step you do not want to skip because if you lose your keys, you lose access to your account. So make sure your keys are in a safe place and saved somewhere secure before you proceed. So I just saved my public and private owner and active keys. And I'm going to save there in a safe place and create my account. Great news. My account has been created. Look how easy that was. It took less than a second. So with my account created, Squirrel Wallet 11, I'm going to import it now into Squirrel. Since I just created it, Squirrel knows that this is most likely what I'm going to look for. So guess what? It's already there. It's going to click Look Up Account. It's going to ask me for the private key that's associated with my account. And if you recall, that's what I just saved earlier. So let me copy my private key and paste it here. Click Compare. Awesome. Now, Squirrel's asking me to save my account utilizing a password. So this simply secures access to your Squirrel account on your desktop, just in case someone accesses your, your laptop. Um, they need to know your password in order to get into Squirrel. So let's put a password for my wallet. Let's save it. And that's it. You're presented with the Telos Blockchain Network Operating Agreement. You can just go through that, scroll to the bottom, and accept the terms. And you're in the Telos Blockchain with the new account you just created. So what we're going to do now is, if you notice, there's no uh, tokens on our account. So let's load that up by just making a quick purchase or some tokens. Simply click the Carbon Profile button uh, to begin the registration process to the exchange. So let's click Get Started. And this simply shows us which public key is going to be associated with our account. We can uh, enter an email address uh, so that we could receive transaction summaries and notifications. So let's do that and click Register. That's it. We're currently registered to the uh, exchange. There's an optional KYC process as well. 
And if you'd like to proceed with that, you can do so now. Otherwise, you can just start purchasing your tokens right away. The KYC process allows you to increase your limits, your daily purchase limits from $250 per day to $2,500 per day. But we're just gonna skip that step. So let's click close. All right, now we see that the buy tell us button is now available. Let's get this going. So click buy tell us, and we're gonna make a purchase of $15. Now, there are other coins that uh, we support, which includes buying Bitcoin and EOS. But for the purposes of this demonstration, we're gonna buy tell us and uh, our squirrel wallet one one uh, first purchase. This memo would appear on the blockchain uh, once the transaction has gone through. So just confirm your account uh, that will receive the funds and click next and enter the credit card number that you'd like to use. Now this confirmation screen just gives you a summary of the information that you entered as well as the details of your purchase. When you're ready to go, simply click confirm purchase just to authorize the transaction. It only takes about a minute. Now, if there uh, are any problems with this transaction, you're going to receive a confirmation. So let's wait here. And there it is. So the transaction is successful. Let's uh, check the history to see if we've received our tokens. And we now have 193 Telos uh, that we just purchased directly within the Square Wallet. Now, isn't this amazing? I encourage you guys to go ahead and take advantage of this feature. There are a lot more um, plans uh, to withdraw tokens and uh, provide atomic swaps. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed this video. Have a great day, guys.